The M1 Garand is the standard rifle that the US Army uses in Hell Let Loose. It is more forgiving than the Car 98K due to it being a semi-automatic rifle and that it holds more bullets before it needs to be reloaded. In this video, I'll be showing you where to aim to get headshots from 100 meters up to 300 meters and where to aim to hit running and sprinting targets. I will also be looking at how many body shots it takes to kill at these ranges. So if you like the sound of that, then give this video a like a and subscribe for more. So first up is 100 meters and we're looking for how many bullets it takes to kill in a body shot. And it's just one. With headshots at 100 meters, you just get the head at the tip of the iron sight. For running and sprinting targets 100 meters, you just need to get your target on the curved part of the iron sight, as shown in the highlighted circle. At 150 meters, it actually takes two body shots to kill a target with the M1. For headshots, just get your enemy's head just below the tip of your sight. For running and sprinting targets, the aim point seems to be pretty much the same as 100 meters. It really feels like the bullet velocity for the M1 Garand is a lot faster than the Car 98K after doing all these tests. Bullets to kill at 200 meters remains at 2. Headshots at 200 meters, you need to get your target's head just below the tip of the sight. For running and sprinting targets at 200 meters, just like 150 meters, you need to get your target along the curved part of the iron sight, but you just need to be a little bit more precise. Bullets to kill at 250 meters stays at 2. For your headshot, again, just a little bit further down the sight, check out the red dot on the picture. And moving on to the running and sprinting speed, it seems to be pretty much exactly like 200 meters. From doing all these tests with the M1, it just seems like the bullet drop, it, you know, it doesn't really have that much bullet drop, and the bullet velocity is pretty damn good. Bullets to kill at 300 meters is again two shots. For your 300 meter headshot, the aim point pretty much seems to be exactly like 250 meters. For your running and sprinting targets at 300 meters, you need to get your target at the bottom of the curved part of the site. After getting all this footage, it really shows that the M1 has less bullet drop and a higher bullet velocity compared to the Car 98K, along with having a better iron sight, in my opinion anyway. So I hope this video helps you out. If it does, give it a like and subscribe for more, as I'll be looking at the other weapons as well. If you haven't seen my video on the Car 98K, then check it out here, and thank you for watching.